on Brandon McNerney's McNerney's uh, mistrial. You know, you know, the dude who shot Lawrence King in the back of the head in Oxnard, and then he got a mistrial because their defense was like, uh, they're like, oh yeah, the kid was hitting on him, so you know he deserved to get killed. For there is not a bone, an evil bone in the body. No organ with a hundred wicked tongues. No gland that matures and pumps corruption once this corset of hormones has snapped into place. There is no science to this. No vicious forceps to twist out. No living thing to pull from another. Look instead to the ritual broke open on the rock and the buzzards that flock to it. All those books that come from Colorado and the men who write them, the paper that fronts like it can claim history, what paper? You can't hold nothing but words, and those don't mean a thing outside all this fleshy architecture. Look instead to the television hum and the mechanics in the gun, how the boy held it in his knapsack like a book waiting to open, what the laughter did once all the mouths closed. How a valentine became serrated paper. The heavy metal in his hand he pressed to King's ear like a warm slur. How before, his face was a calm paper airplane in the mirror at home. All that disgusting makeup. Who'd believe me if I only said no? And the jury that threw the case out. And Lawrence eclipsed by a snow white martyr. And the gun that spoke twice. All children are born knowing the taste of blood, but none with the desire to take it. If you dig up a hundred graves, you could find that all we become is paper. <laughs>